Hi YouTube, this is Ben from New England Millsurp, and today I'm going to show you how to field strip a FEG PA63. This is a Hungarian made Walther PP copy. Um, as you can see on the side, it is not chambered in 9mm, it's chambered in 9mm Makarov, also called 9x18mm. Um, this is actually one of my carry guns that I currently use, and uh, I've found it to be pretty much flawless. It cycles pretty amazingly, um, it's very easy to conceal, and it's just an all-around very good gun, very accurate. Um, I mean, obviously one of the only downfalls is it does use single-stack magazines rather than the more common modern ones that are double-stacked, but I haven't really had too much of an issue with that, and I find that if I carry one extra magazine, I have enough rounds that I can feel like I could pretty consistently defend myself against anything that I might have to be engaging. So I will show you how to uh, field strip this. With all guns, the first thing that you want to do is make sure that they are safe and clear whenever you're handling them or field stripping them. So what you're going to do is take the magazine out and check the chamber. And there's nothing in the chamber, so that is clear now. This comes apart just like any other uh, Wal Walther PP variant, uh, just like the PP, just like the PPK. It's very simple. Um, there is this rod that comes down, which is the trigger guard, and it allows you to take the slide right off of the gun. I don't know if I can do this with my hands in this sense, so hold on a second. Bear with me. So as you can see, you just you pull it down, and it allows you to take the slide right off of the gun. So now you have the slide off, and you could take your spring off, but when you put it back together, you have to make sure that the large end is towards the front of the slide and the small end is at the back of the barrel. Um, other than that, that's really all you have to do for field stripping. As you can see, this one's a little dirty because it's been in my pocket a lot. But um, yeah, once you get it apart like this, that's, that's about all there is to it very simple and once you know how to take apart this gun you could very easily take apart any other Walther PP variant. Um, they all come apart basically the same way even things like uh, the Ivor Johnson TP-22 which is a very small handgun based off the Walther PPK um, they all come apart just like this and to put it together as I said you want to make sure that the larger end is towards the end of the slide and the slide goes oh, back on and back into place. And that's about all there is to it. So yeah, that's how you uh, you disassemble a PA63.